Yeah, yeah, he's got some energy for it. Hey, awesome doodle fans. We are here in Orlando, Florida. I have met uh, Pedro and his two sons. This is Samuel and Tomas. And you guys have seen Tomas on video before. Uh, Pedro, it's so nice to finally meet you. We've been talking for, I don't know, four years or something. Absolutely, absolutely. And it's uh, for us, it's a true pleasure to finally put the face and yeah, the body me too. Um, behind the voice, the knowledge, and I think the good in the world that you represent through, okay. the, through the dogs. Yeah. So, uh, just a little recap for everybody, uh, Pedro and his family, they got a dog named Tula from us, I guess it's been a year and a half ago, Yes. right? Yes. Um, Tula had a tragic accident with a uh, cone, oh, you? Yes. a cone around her head, and I'm going to put a link to the other video, yes. so you guys don't use the same cone that, uh, that they used on Tula. Your bed, I guess. Yes, yes. It was one of those um, hard cones, um, and I've seen in the videos now on the Awesome Doodle site that people are using softer cones, um, and I think it was a tragic um, event. But the good thing is that people are now learning to use other devices to protect yeah. their pets whenever they get those kind of surgeries. Well, you know what's the real coincidental thing is, you know, when you call me that day to tell me about Tula. That, uh, Winnie, my dog Winnie, was right. getting spayed, and they had sent her home in that same exact cone. Right. Yeah, and I think, I'm sure they've tested it, I'm sure that, you know, it's gone through the whatever approval process it is for any of those devices. Mm -hmm. um, I think this was just kind of like one of those freak accidents of nature, I don't know, yeah. um, you know, probably one of those 1% accidents that occur on the side of her. It was just tragic, and, and I think it is because since it's so hard and it was kind of tight, you know, the impact actually hit her neck. And unfortunately, I mean, I saw it on the x ray. I, I could see right. one of the little vertebrae in the back, you know, kind of like dislodged, and there was nothing nothing that we could actually. So she actually had a neck injury? Yeah, it was a neck injury. Um, and it was tragic. And, but out of that, I mean, you can try for days, we still try. Yeah. Um, I mean, there is something good coming out of that. Um, just people are now using other devices um, to fit that purpose. Right. Um, so I can set the words right out. And now we get, um, thanks to you and to the awesome noodles, I mean, we get to have this um, precious little boy that yeah. we will teach and make him part of the family. Yeah. So this will be your second awesome doodle. And this is uh, a puppy from Mini Pucci. Right. Uh, London's puppies were, people had great things to say about London's puppies, that was Tula's mom. And of course, Minnie Pucci, this was her third and final litter. Um, so, uh, it's really great that you guys were able to get one of Minnie Pucci's puppies. Yes, I mean, um, I've seen Minnie Pucci on a video. Yeah. Um, and I see her demeanor, I see her behavior. Um, I just hope that, you know, some of that genetic translates to Wookie, because I mean, um, we do like to go out, um, and when we had Tula, we could take her out everywhere. I took her to some people, I took her to some restaurants, I took her anywhere I could, I put that yeah. dog with me. Yeah. We'll, we'll apply the same, you know, for this little boy, yeah. um, so we can get him socialized. Um, yeah. And I hope he keeps some of those traits from from Gucci, I'm um, sure this will. generation. Yes, I'm sure it will. Yeah. <laughs> As you can see, he's not shy. He's not uh, scared at all. He's uh, very adventurous. Very. <laughs> well, that's fine, right? To get the opportunity to get to know the world um, at that yeah. age. Um, I think that um, we do travel and we take our pets with us. Yeah. Um, so, you know, he's going to have a great time because I mean, yeah. you get to know different places and, you know, be out and about. Yeah. I wish I could have uh, met your wife, Monica, and. Um, I know she couldn't be here tonight, but Larissa wanted me to tell you hi. Absolutely. Because likewise. Likewise. She was one of the first people you made contact with when you... Yes, and actually, um, Monica couldn't be here, uh, but um, I know that she feels so grateful and it 
inspired and about you know what has happened over the last months um, in our interaction. Um, you know, for us, it's an indication that there's still you know like good in the world, um, and actually our family, you know, wherever they are, either in Venezuela or in Colombia mm -hmm. or in mm -hmm. Panama, they all know the story and they all felt oh, so Boston. heartfelt, right? In Boston. in Boston too, right? I mean, they all felt like, right. wow, this is so great what they've done for you that it's great that to see that there's you know still some good in the world. Well, you guys, this, what happened to you guys? This was not fair. It just, it just was not fair, and I just, I just could not accept it. <laughs> yeah, yeah and, and actually, you know, for us, um, it, was, yeah, it was so sad. I think, um, you know, our, our, our hearts sank. You know, when you have that feeling that your heart just sinks and goes um, deep. Um, um, but yeah. you know, um, yeah. you know, it's, we've learned our lesson. Um, we recoup from that a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, we still miss like the steps on the wood. Um, you know, feel the steps like the little jingle. Um, right. Right. But you know, this boy is gonna do his own, right? He has his own personality, and um, you know, he'll let us run and we'll love him. And um, it's just great, absolutely great. Well, Samuel, um, hold him up there between you and Tomas. So, uh, so the camera can. <laughs> okay, awesome doodle fans. The next time you guys see Wookie, he's gonna be fetching a frisbee, or he's gonna be chasing a ball. Because I know you guys are gonna send me lots of pictures and videos. Oh, yes, absolutely. As soon as I get his first training sessions run, yeah. I'll, I'll send those updates. Well, um, you know, Mini Pucci is a frisbee. Star, right? So he's gonna be too. Yeah, I'll, I'll do my best to get him. You know, as soon as the time comes, get him up on that. You know, backyard. I'm to excited. Teach him how to fetch. Absolutely. Okay, guys, wait for the camera. Thank Open you. Up. Thank you. Bye. All right, awesome little fans. Next time you see Tula. She'll probably be catching a frisbee or fetching a ball or something. Right, Wookie. <laughs> we're going to start that over. <laughs> <laughs>